Hello, in this video demonstration we will review the full text search feature which has been newly introduced in the Microsoft Dynamics X 2012 R3. Full text search functionality simplifies the search of required customer specific information at the time of order entry or simplifies the search of required product while adding the new sales line. We first need to complete the required setup before we can use this functionality. Let us review the product demonstration for the same. A required setup for the full text search functionality can be located under the sales and marketing. Under the setup, under the search, we have a search parameters. Here we can set up the different search parameters. We can define the number of records to be displayed in the search form, whether search text should be matched fully or partially. If we check automatically fill customer search, we can search the required customer specific information at the time of order entry and if we select automatically fill item search we can search the required product information at the time of adding new sales line and this will save the search type then as a next step we need to define the criteria which can be located under the search then click on different criteria here we need to add all criteria which we would like to use for searching. Here we have a different filters. We can add criteria for customer, item and prospect. If we select customer, we can add a new criteria here. Here we have already included the customer name as a one of the searching criteria. We can add additional criteria from this drop down menu. For example, account name, address, bank account, likewise. For now we will continue with the customer name. We, similarly we can also add criteria for product search. Here we have added two criteria item id and product name. And similarly we can also add it for a prospect. Notice that once we add the criteria we need to click refresh in order to update the index. So when we click refresh it will ask for the confirmation. And here we can select which criteria we would like to update. Since in our case we are using the customer criteria as well as product criteria, we need to update the index for both of them one by one. For now we will update it for item. So now we have index up to date for customer as well as item and we can start using this search function. In order to use this function we can go to the account receivable and try to create a new sales order. Click on sales order tab from action menu and then under the new group click on new sales order. Here we have a search by field where select the keyword and then we can simply type the customer name. We don't remember the full customer name so we can type a part of the customer name say hotel and press tab. It will find out all the customers matching this criteria. So here as we can see we have three customers having a hotel as a part of their name. So we can select one of these customers say hotel Germany and click on select customers. If for example customer does not exist we can create a new customer by clicking on new customer or we can edit the customer details from by clicking on edit customer or even we can send it, send it as a catalog. So for now we select the customer by clicking on select customer and this will fill in the required information for the selected customer. We have additional options as well. For example, we can search based on the sales order, purchase order, phone number, customer account. These are already pre-configured and can be used without completing any required setup. However, if you would like to search based on the keyword, we need to enable the required parameters for the same. Similarly, we can also use the full text search on a sales line while selecting the product. Just type in the product name and then press tab and that will list out all the products matching with the criteria.